Hi everyone, my name's Lawrence Hooker and I'm a technical consultant here at Excitec. I specialise in Autodesk Revit and also Autodesk Inventor. The idea of this video is to give you an overview of the subjects we'll be covering on our Autodesk Revit Structure Fundamentals course. During the course you will receive a full Ascent training manual, a number of different handouts as well as a USB stick to save your work and also at the end of the course you will receive an Autodesk certificate. So our journey really begins by taking a look at BIM and the Revit interface. We generally start off by taking in an architectural project and start to look at the information that the architect has put into the model, different ways of extracting that information, be it a schedule, be it 2D drawings and so on. And what we then do is use this as a basis to build up our structural project. So we run this like a real world project. We will start by inserting some architectural data that may have come from 2D or 3D source. We'll then move into the concrete superstructure. So we'll look at column systems here, selecting columns, changing them, that sort of thing. Then we'll look at creating a structural grid system, also annotating that grid. In the process, we'll also, of course, look at levels as well, building up load-bearing walls, non-load-bearing walls. Uh, this could be for core walls, shear walls, and so on. Then we look at the steel superstructure. So we'll be looking at primary beam systems, secondary beam systems, and also good tools to allow us to create bracing configurations and so on. We then move into some 2D detailing. So we look at uh, creating and generating 2D details of called out views within uh, Revit itself. A little look at rendering. More importantly, we take a look at the analytical model, adding loads, boundary conditions, and also perhaps the transfer to structural analysis applications as well. We take a look at um, creating schedules as part of our two-dimensional documentation. And of course, finally then, we end up by putting the views onto a drawing sheet. And our course is then finished. Of course, your learning path has only just started with Revit. To see some of the other courses we offer, uh, particularly more advanced courses, you can go to our website at www.excitec.co.uk. You can attend the training at our London Centre, Bishopsgate, or alternatively, you can attend training at our Enfield Centre or perhaps your own site. I hope this has been useful. For more information, don't hesitate to contact us. Hope to see you soon.